after six years off the air. This is what I look like now. He's back with The Problem with Jon Stewart on Apple TV Plus, airing every other week. Each episode takes a deep dive into one problem facing the country. Was there any part of you that decided to come back to TV because of anything that's happened in the last five years where you felt like, I wish I had a show right now, because if I did, I would say this. Not really. I get to get things off my chest all the time. I have children. I think there's a sense sometimes that when you're not on television, you stop existing because that's how people sort of see you. I experienced it, it all in all of its glory and all of its uh, trauma and was expressing myself pretty consistently <laughs> throughout, just not on television. I read you felt like being away from that daily grind. You said that life got richer and more colorful. And I liked that. It feels like one of those videos where the guy puts on the glasses for the first time and sees colors. It's like, <laughs> I had no idea that all this was going on. For the first few months after leaving the show, I was a little Forrest Gumpy, just out in the world like, huh, what? You don't need to swipe the card, you just hold it up and suddenly the groceries are yours? <laughs> impossible! Even to the point of just being able to pick the kids up from school and driving them home and listen to the conversation in the back. And I think that informed how I went back to doing another television show. I believe they refer to it as balance. I was just about to say, Jon Stewart, sounds like you have it all. Uh, what? I Ding! <laughs> looking for a good little ending. How do you like that as an ending? It's, it's nice. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.